for all the negative energy spirit hi guys thank you guys for tuning in to real life tarot with renee this today's reading is going to be for the sign of gemini for may 12 2021 this is your midweek reading gemini's how are you doing i'm just clearing the energies from the cards okay any negative energies I already said the pre-prayer before I started the recording, okay? Yeah. I hope everybody's doing well. I hope you had an amazing Mother's Day weekend. You guys, I'm sorry. I have not been able to get to your sign just uh, before today. Um, yeah, it's been like kind of super duper crazy, but I'm here. All right, love bugs. <clears throat> Let's get into it. You guys, um, please note that all of the messages that I will be reading today will not resonate with every Gemini out here, okay? So only take what resonates and leave the rest. If this story doesn't fit, you know you must acquit, okay? Sorry, this deck is pretty. I don't know why this deck feels so thick. <laughs> I always like have to sometimes split up the deck or whatever. Like, this is how it comes. Yeah. My hands can't take all that. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm a shuffle. Real good. You guys, um, make sure you hit the um, like, share, subscribe button as well. It helps circulate the video. Oh my goodness. To other um, Gemini's out there who's looking for the same messages as you. Okay. And thank you guys who already... Um, subscribe and donate um, to the channel and helping it grow i appreciate every last single one of you guys also to you guys mark your calendar is monday monday may 17th i will be going live uh, for um the collective all signs so make sure you guys check in with me it's going to be at eight o'clock sharp okay i can't wait to meet all of you guys and chat it up with you and yeah and give you also a live um Love energy read as well. So this is going to be fun. I'm excited for that. All right, Gemini, let's get into your reading. Let's go. Let's go, Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit. Please give me honest messages for the sign of Gemini in love. For May 12, 2021. Thank you, Spirit. Ooh, we'll call it off a lot like that, but I'm not going to take them like that. Give me honest messages. Spirit, don't be gossiping like all like... Okay, I'll take this one though. Okay, Nine of Cups. Mmm. What's going on? Oh, nice with your little Nine of Cups. Mm -hmm. Somebody want to come in and give you some love? I'll take them. Yeah, I'll just go and take them since it's going to be like this. Oh, we got the world upside down though. Something isn't over. Uh huh. Three of Pentacles, Ace of Wands. Somebody definitely wants to come in and work. Um work with you as a team maybe collaborate on something um to that effect and then with the ace of wands somebody is like yeah wanting to start something new um you know create a um when i see this with the ace of wands and it's just this one now it's like someone's also extending the olive branch right mm -hmm. that's how i read that card as well and then you have this line of cups here which is somebody um it's going to have some um, abundance coming in, um, some good health, wealth, possibly, or whatever. But also, too, like whatever you thought was ended, it's not ended. The world is in reverse. So that means that um, something you have like unfinished business, okay? That's what that's telling me, okay? All right, so let's get into it. Hold on, let me see. Oh, some of these cards are just all the way flipped, all the way over. Ciao get in the right way okay hold on guys okay all right so let's see here let's see what we're working with i'm gonna clarify the vice for holy spirit clarify the nine of cups for gemini's thank you mm -hmm. mm. we got the two of cups in reverse mm -hmm. somebody's gone through um a breakup Let me see here. 
clarify the two of cups in reverse. Clarify the two of cups in reverse, spirit. Source. Somebody has a messenger, but also somebody is fine after this breakup as well. Okay, so hmm, we go from the nine of how like we go from the nine to the two of cups in reverse to the page of swords. Maybe somebody was hoping for this breakup. What's the world in reverse? Four of Oh, okay. Yeah, somebody's laying something to rest. Okay, gotcha. So, Gemini, you are moving on to something better, right? With the Nine of Cups or whatever, like, you're moving towards your abundance after a breakup or whatever. And with this Page of Swords, this Page of Swords is telling me that, um, yeah, you definitely have somebody gossiping and spying on you or whatever. Possibly the person that you just broke up with. This could be you or your person. Take it how it resonates. Yeah, you've decided um, um, with the Four of Swords, um, with the world in reverse, something is an overdose. You think you think it is, but some, your person could have whatever the issue was that caused this breakup. Your person could be laying at the rest. Yeah. Five of Swords energy. Mm -hmm. Five of Swords is telling me too that uh, somebody was a, being abusive in the relationship or whatever. So you could have put put the situation to rest, um, but your person um, feels like it's unfinished business. Thank you for clarifying. Okay. Um, this is the Three of Pentacles because whoever this is, they also want to come back in and collaborate with you now, right? Clarify the Three of Swords spirit. Spirit. No, that's a lot. No. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll be going in with spirit. <laughs> Don't worry, too. You guys know I'm going to go into the hood story because I kind of want to know, like, specifically what happened now with the world. Hold on, guys. Hey, my dad's up. Nine of Cups. Three, three of Pentacles, Spirit. Without gossiping all at one time. Thank you, Spirit. Goodness gracious. Okay, the Eight of Swords is in reverse. It, it flipped down in reverse. Okay, so yeah, somebody is becoming unbound. Mm -hmm. With like, um, like now you're free from the situation, right? You you don't want to collaborate with them. That's what it sounded like, Gemini. Yeah, you're unbound. You're unbound. You 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 freed yourself from this situation. Yeah, clarify the Eight of Swords, um, Spirit in reverse. Clarify the Eight of Swords in reverse. Thank you, Spirit. I see you popping your head. Okay, no, that's too many. Sorry, I was mistaken. Give me one card <laughs> for the Eight of Swords in reverse. Thank you, Spirit. I'll take it. Mm. Yeah. Justice has been served. Libra energy. You can be dealing with the Libra or have that in your chart. You or your person, okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You're free. Just has been served. Whatever truth needed to come up be um needed to come out about the situation. You're um you you've either gonna receive this truth or you've gotten the truth already. Yeah. But whoever this is, your person that you were dealing with that you had this breakup from, they're spying on you now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What's the Ace of Wands? Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. Judgment. Yep. And could possibly be facing their karma now. Ooh-wee. Yep. That's what it's saying. Yeah. They could definitely be um, facing their karma right now. Yeah. With this Ace of Wands. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. Are you made it in, in or you made a decision? Mm -hmm. It could be definitely both. 
Yeah, you made a decision mm -hmm, to move on, move forward. Clarify judgment. Thank you, Spirit. Oh, goodness. Okay. Yeah. Ten of Swords. Yeah, because it was a heavy burden. Mm-hmm. This, this, this relationship was a heavy burden for sure. And it's just like, you know what? I put this whole thing to rest. I'm over it. Um, you know, I'm moving on the five of swords. You could have been dealing with a very abusive person. Um, at the same time, it's just like, you know, it was just unhealthy. It was just an unhealthy, toxic relationship. Um, it could be, you know, whether it's physical, verbal, psychological, you're like over it. And you felt trapped in that uh, relationship too with the eight of swords in reverse, but you freed yourself. You've gotten justice from the situation. Yeah. Uh, but, um, yeah, with the world in reverse is saying that you have unfinished business with this person or they feel like they have unfinished business with you. They definitely want to come in. Yeah. With the page of pentacles and offer you this little weak ass offer. You know, um, <laughs> sorry, Gemini, but I'm just keep it a thou wow. Yeah, um, they want to bring in this little news. Yeah, and then we have the five of wands in reverse here, and that's telling me too that somebody wants to come in with peace and harmony and resolve the situation. But I don't know. It looks like you're you're just not feeling it. Give me more, spirit. Give me more. Yeah. Now you have free will. You are welcome to rest. You know, if, if this is your person and this is, you know, um, your soulmate, I don't know because it's not telling me that yet. Those cards have not fell out that this is your soulmate. You could definitely be um, very well dealing with the karmic situation here. Yeah. Ace of Cups in reverse. Yeah. No happy family for you. Yes, in the reverse, baby. Yeah, because you're tired of being let down, being depressed about this situation, constantly arguing with a mofo. Like, ain't nobody got time for that. Especially if it's a karmic. I don't even see this is your soulmate. Like, I'm not getting soulmate, you know, not as of yet because we haven't gotten into the hood cards and the hood cards could say something different. Is there any more messages, um, Spirit for Gemini's in love? Who's over this toxic situation? Who's laying this um, relationship to complete rest? With the four swords, I can't make it up. I'm just saying. <laughs> you over it. Like you over it. Ace of Cups in reverse. You guys know that's the 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 love card, you know. And um, yeah, ain't no love there. <laughs> you, like, yeah, you, you're like pulling back your love, Gemini. Mm -hmm. That's your energy. Yeah. But this person wants to come in, make up, and have peace and harmony with you. With the five of wands in reverse. And it's just like, yeah, you're just like, mm, yeah. They want to resolve the situation with you, but you're kind of iffy about it. You, you, not even iffy. It sounds pretty solid. Um, all these cards is uh, coming out it's solid. Um, on your end, yeah. She's the Queen of Pentacles. Mm hmm Yeah. All right, let's go into the backstory. Yeah. So. Basically, this is like, I'm over it. I'm tired of your abusive behavior. I don't want to deal with this anymore. I'm going to put this up here. Very significant. You're trying to be in the five of swords energy with this person. Very toxic or whatever you've done. You don't want to give your love to this person anymore, okay? With the eight of, um, with the eight of, sorry, the five of wands or whatever. They want to come back. Um, They want to come back or whatever and... and Heal this, but you're like, yeah, no. Mm -mm. I just want to work on my pinnacles. You're probably the queen of pinnacles. You're probably very career driven. Um, all about your money, that type of thing or whatever. But you, yeah, justice is served though. Period. You got justice in this situation. You made your decision already. And yeah, they want to come in this with this little weak offer because now it's a burden for them to be without you. But they didn't think about these things um, before. You see what I'm saying? They want to come in and, and with this Ace of Wands energy or whatever. They're definitely spying on you. But you're like, you could spy all you want to, but that's not going to bring me back to you, okay? Like, you, like they would have to be do a complete turnaround in this relationship, okay? All right. So, um, I'm going to go into the hood deck. I pre-shuffled these because this would be too much. Um, trying to shuffle some time on camera. Um, yeah, but you guys, this is the, yeah, this is the energy that you're in right now. Um, I'm going to pull the, um, some messages uh, from your person. 
um, to see how they're feeling as well after I get into the back hood story of this um, situation and what could have possibly happened, who you're dealing with, okay? Um, you know, we may get some, um, some energies here. Yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm, childish, mm -hmm, immature behavior. Thank you, Spirit. We'll start there. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Yeah. So the person he was dealing with clearly was dealing with childish immature um, behavior, period. Mm -hmm. Could have had some addictions that caused you to break up with them. You know what I'm saying? Um, regardless of what they were, whether they were drugs, toxicity, you know, who knows? You know, any type of addiction or whatever, sex addiction, you know what I'm saying? You could be dealing with initials D, first, middle, last, yours, and theirs. Yeah. Had you all depressed. You know what I'm saying? Feeling sad, um, being in a stuck mentality, withdrawn from your friends, family, and all of that. But now that's their energy. Mm -hmm. Initials O, J, wow, V. You guys, tell me if these are your people in the comments, okay? And if this is your story, yeah, they're in complete despair. They want to fix this so bad, right? They want to reconcile. I can't make it up because before they were wearing a false mask, right? But for you, you got the world in the upright. It's done data it's in your on to new beginnings you learned your lesson for this relationship and they're saying no one loved me the way you did period of course not but you couldn't appreciate me when you had me right mm. initials p first middle last yours are theirs yeah staying with them kept you in a repeated cycle it did it kept you in a repeated cycle and this is like now you have the eight of uh swords in reverse right you're breaking free from this prison because in the upright look how look how she's tied up look at that tied up or whatever and you know what i'm saying trapped can't can't get loose you know what i'm saying look how she's blindfolded you love this person you couldn't see before but in the upright, you're like, oh, no, I can't keep going through this. Yeah. And in, in the reverse, though, mm -mm, you freed yourself. You're like, I'm done, Dada. Yeah. Because you're on to the, your nine of cups to your new beginning towards your abundance. Yeah. You're tired of going through this repeated cycle with this person. Mm -hmm. Children could be a factor in this situation. They could have had a secret baby or um, some type of pregnancy on you. You or them. I'm just saying. But it sounds like this could have been your person. Who, who stepped out on, on the situation, you know, in the relationship. Or you could have children with this person already and it's um, affecting your children. You know what I'm saying? The abusive, you know, behavior and all of that as well. Initials S, first, middle, last. Yeah. But in reality, this person was wearing a false mask, but you were really everything to this person. They just didn't know how to treat you. They're always thinking about you and missing you. Ciao. Give me more spirit. Give me more spirit to the backstory. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is significant. Wearing a false mask, lying. Yeah. I didn't... Um, I three of Pentacles out here, but I didn't see... I don't know. I don't know if this is a third party. Yeah, let's see though. Yeah, secrets. Your person was definitely keeping secrets from you. Uh-huh, being sneaky. Yeah, like they're sneaking out because with this page of swords energy, they're sneaking and watching you probably by uh, with a fake profile, uh huh, fake page on social media, Instagram, Twitter, whatever. Yeah, Facebook watching you. Mm hmm. But you reap what you sow. Yeah. And the spirit is saying, if you take this person back, be cautious, move slow, be aware, watch them. Watch them the way they watch you. Watch their behavior. Watch what they say. Right. Versus what they do. Because mm -hmm. you could say whatever, but your actions tell everything. Initials F. Yeah, there is an energy thief. Still in all your energy. Initials H. Chow. Mm. I understand Gemini. It'd be a lot. <laughs> yeah. Chow, but this was your emperor doing this to you? Wow. So it could be your soulmate. You guys tell me in the comment field. Yeah, or you could have been married to this person. Yep. You could have definitely very well been married to this person, especially with children being a factor here. Mm hmm Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Oh, what's that? Mm hmm But they want to take a leap of faith. Yeah, of course they do. It came out in the cards. 
The five of wands are reversed. They want to take a leap of faith to come towards you and bring harmony to the situation and heal it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, within one month, that's when they want to come in. Yeah, they're plotting. That's why they're watching. But they're so fearful that you're going to reject them. Yeah, justice card came out. And here, look at Libra. You could be dealing with the Libra. Mm hmm Look, can't make it up. Thank you, spirit. Oh, shoot. Hold on, I have to take these out of my hand. Yeah, gossiping card. Mm hmm Gossiping, jealousy. Um, you're dealing with fake friends, haters, too, on top of. Yeah, this is the gossiping. This is the gossiping card. Page of Swords. They're definitely spying on you. They want to come in with a message or whatever, um, but they're watching you. Yeah, that's what that is. Yeah, they were very manipulative in the past. Emotionally manipulative. Trickster, playing games, and all of that kind of silly shit. Yeah, but now they want stability with you. Mm -hmm. They want abundance with you. But, you know, have they done the work? That's the question. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're in regret and sorrow over this connection. But you will get justice, Libra energy. And the justice card did come out. Yeah, where's justice? Right here. Boom, can't make it up. Yeah, and you've already gotten just of you. If you've already left this connection, you left this person out in the cone, baby. It's a reset. Yeah, for a lot of you guys, you're done done. Because like when you get the card, the um the eight of uh the the eight of wands, um, was this that what energy was this? The uh yeah. Did I see when you get this, um sorry. The Eight of Swords, I said Eight of Wands. Eight of Swords in reverse like this, you're free. You're like, oh, hell no. I cannot keep going through this with you. And you probably have been dealing with this from this person. Let me put this up here. You probably have been dealing with this person for quite some time as well. And, you know, after a while, it's just like, and you're dealing with your emperor child. Um, yeah. I didn't see third party coming out here, coming out. Uh, come come out um, in the card. So that's kind of like a good sign, I guess, or whatever. It's just this person's mentality. You know what I'm saying? Abusive, toxic. Could have been very controlling um, as well. You know what I'm saying? Nobody wants to deal with that in a relationship. Period. It gets old after a while. It gets really old. And especially if you have kids... You have to put your kids first. You know what I'm saying? They, you know, and that's like the hardest thing I know because a lot of people stay in a relationship with the kids and a lot of times it's doing more harm to the kids staying in a toxic situation than letting it go and then trying to like, you know what I'm saying, co-parent amicably, you know what I'm saying, and without the toxicity, you know. It's okay to move on, you know. But somebody have you know, you know, a lot of you may have that old way of thinking, like, well, you know, I don't want to break up my home. I mean, clearly nobody wants to break up their family. But if se separation is required in order for you guys to get back on track, so that you can, um, you know, show your children healthy love in a home, that's what needs to be done. Period. Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, what's the uh, current energy? What is a um, Gemini's person want to say to them? What's the message that Gemini's person wants to say to them. This is the love tarot deck, you guys, for soulmates or whatever. And the only reason I'm pulling this out too is um, I was going to pull it out anyways, but I'm really pulling it out because um, Emperor came out. So this could be your divine counterpart as well. Thank you, Spirit, for that message. And I'm going to give you guys some angel oracle messages after this. Give me more. Thank you, spirit. Any more messages from Gemini's person? I have to give four solid men. Okay, now this one. It's flipped in here, but I'm going to put it back in here. Thank you, spirit. Okay. Yeah. So your person wants to tell you, I'm still trying to find a place for myself in the world. Yeah, your person was definitely dealing with some type of self um you know, some self-conflicted traumas or, or wounds or something like that. Yeah. I want you to see the real me now. I've been hiding from our love for too long. Yeah, here we go. Because they've been wearing a false mask. Uh-huh. And, and this could be, you don't necessarily have to be married to this person, but for some of you guys, you, you could be. That's the energy that I'm getting. You tell me in the comment fields. Yeah. I, ch ooh, 
Then I say I wasn't sure if a third party was involved because it didn't really come out outside of the Three of Pentacles. Um, but that they want to come in and collaborate. But that also could tell me too that that could have been like other people involved in this situation. Like um, because the gossip card came out as well. But it says I cheated. I cheated you out of real love. I ghosted you because of my own insecurities. So I'm getting the energy too that they ghosted you. Um, they could have left the situation, whether it's for a third party or not. I'm not sure, um, but they did ghost you, okay? Yeah, and I'm sorry for judging you and hurting your feelings. Yeah, mm-hmm, yeah. So this is what they want to say. Uh, let me see if they have any more messages for you guys. Yeah, for a lot of you guys, this was not a third party. I'm not feeling that, but I feel like other people could have been a factor with the gossiping card or whatever. Um, your person could have been heavily um, or easily influenced by others in the connection. And, um, you know, you have people in their ear or whatever, gossiping and spying. But at the same time, your person is looking um, at your social media secretly and um, trying to see how to approach you. Mm -hmm. Time has brought me clarity about us and I made the wrong choices. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And I'm confused about what I should do about my feelings for you. Now I have issue with that. That's their message, but I have issues with that because you should never be confused about the person that you love, right? That's just me. I don't know. You guys, you know, take it as it resonates. And I keep track of you from afar by looking you up online. Didn't I tell y'all? <laughs> exactly. The gossiping card is here. Yeah. That page of swords. Mm-hmm. Definitely looking at you. Yeah, there he is. A little spy card. And then and then you had the spy and then gossip and the spy came out again. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's exactly what's going on. Yeah, they want to approach you, but they're fearful at the same time. They don't know how to really fix this situation, but they just know that they, they don't want to lose you. Okay, all right. So let's get some angel messages and I'm going to let you guys go, Gemini. Okay. Hold on just one second. Oh, okay. Mm -mm. It be like that sometimes. It really do. Okay. Divine messages. Oh, divine spirit. Give me messages. Oh, spirit is saying trust though. Mm, maybe trust your decision or trust that you could work this out. Okay. Give me. Give me angel oracle messages, spirit. Give me more for Gemini in love. Give me more, spirit. Thank you. I'll take those. Okay, and then that's it. All right. Yeah, so spirit is trusting this. says no need to worry about this, okay? Okay. Yeah, and that big happy changes are coming, okay? Yeah, so... Hmm. And it says meditation bring answers. Yeah, so think about it. Yeah, and when you, they come in to bring you this message, this little page, message, this little page of pinnacles, offer, whatever. And, you know, it's not much, you know, because they don't know how to fix the situation. But, you know, Spirit is saying communicate clearly because, you know, pages are messengers, okay? Yeah, they definitely want to come in and talk to you or whatever. So, Spirit is saying, trust and you don't have, you have no need to worry. For those of you who are really seriously like, I'm done, I'm walking away. Spirit is saying, you know, meditate on it and, you know, so that it can bring you the answers that you really need, especially if there's a family involved as well. But if you really love this person, you do have free will to work this out with them. Okay. So don't take my advice. I'm just the messenger. Okay. <laughs> or whatever. I'm just, you know, giving you the read how it's coming out with the situation, but you, you know, but spirit is guiding you saying, trust, do not worry. Okay. You guys see that? Big happy chase, ch uh, changes, okay? Whether that's, regardless if you move forward or stay, okay? Because you did have, um, you had the nine of cups here and that's like good, you know what I'm saying? Like, um, you know, you're, whatever your abundance is or whatever you wish for, whatever you have going on, that's going to come in. So, and that could be for this relationship. It could turn around. Yeah. So just meditate on it. Yeah. And when you guys come in to reconcile, because they do, the reconcile card did come out, you know, communicate clearly. 
but be careful at the same time. The cautious, um, the cautious card did come out, okay? Because, you know, your person was, yeah, clearly wearing a false mask. Your emperor, false mask. Not being honest and truthful about how their feelings. So, yeah. All right, Gemini's, that's all I have for you, love bugs, okay? Thank you guys for watching and tuning in to Real Love Tarot. Make sure to hit the like, share, subscribe button to help the channel grow and get the messages out to other Gemini's who need this, clearly need this message for um, support and healing, okay? And you guys, if you'd like to donate to the channel, you could do so um, at Real Love Tarot via Cash App. And the link to my Cash App is in the description box below. Okay, loves? All right, have an amazing rest of your day and I talk to you soon. Bye.